a rough plastic fence filled with some toys being used by about 30 preschoolers every day. And what a difference it is going to make when this orange line becomes a playground with swings and slides and all kinds of cool stuff. The pictures look amazing. So starting tomorrow, or hopefully tomorrow, uh, Amen. the construction crew is going to be here to start work. And I, what a joy it is to officially break some ground with you. So just want to remind us. <laughs> why it's here but it looks like I don't have to tell you because <laughs> yes we've got a growing number of kids yes we have kids who live down these streets who are going to be able to come here and use it we've got neighbors who are going to be driving by the church and they're going to think oh that's a church that cares about kids right and they're going to think oh maybe I should just bring them by like you remember we put up that basketball hoop and folks in the neighborhood just keep showing up to use it all the time. And that's the hope here, is that folks feel like, oh, I like Norwood. I can head over there. We can play. Kids are welcome and safe there. So thank you for taking a risk to let the whole neighborhood know that we love kids and their families. You heard me say it earlier, but uh, this playground is only possible thanks to uh, a grant from the Visser Found, from the uh, Visser Emerging Ministries Fund. And in honor of that, they're uh, part of that. Uh, the playground chair has suggested we call it Mel's Place. And I love it. Oh, yes. Yay. So, we hope that every kid is welcome at Mel's Place. But this place, once again, doesn't belong to Mel, or to Gloria, or to the playground committee, or to me, or to this church even. This playground. It's for these guys. This is their space. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> we've got three folks here who I want to especially thank. And luckily, all their names start with G. <laughs> so first, the, uh, the chair of our playground team, the committee who put it all together. Uh, also, our lay leader, Gary Willoughby. Would you give him a hand? Yeah, Gary. Gary. All right. And then, once now the playground committee's work is mostly done, that is getting handed to the chair of the trustees because they got to manage the construction and all the busyness there and make sure everything stays in sh shape. So our chair of trustees, Gordy Broadhagen, everybody. But more than the, the actual physical stuff, this is part of our broader push for children and family ministries. And we've had this last year a uh, new chair of that team, uh, someone who has also been running day camp and the living nativity and making sure there are kids opportunities all over the place. So that is the chair of our family ministries team, Georgia Dalton, everybody. But I'm sorry, they don't get to be the first ones to break ground around here. Hey, Abby and Jonathan, now it's, it's the time. Come on over. Right here. Yeah, over there. Right? <laughs> I know they already did it, right? <laughs> You're late to this party, man. We got the earthworms. Jonathan. Jonathan. Hey. Now's the time. <laughs> All right. We're going to let each of them officially dig up the spot. I know. All right. Are you going to take it? Are you going to get out of here? All right. We're trying to hit people. <laughs> so long. Maybe. Are you ready? All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Let's get those three in here too. Good job. <laughs> Gary and Gordy and Georgia, thank you for all your help getting us this far and for taking the reins for the next chunk. We look forward to the day when we can do some ribbon cutting out here, right? Amen. It's going to be fun. All right. You got a good pic. Oh, I got to take a picture of this. You look so good. All right. And three, two, one. Beautiful. All right. And these two. Good. Hey, perfect. All right. Over here. Take it. Let's do one. Big it up, y'all. 
Nice job. Where's Caleb? <laughs> no, I, yeah. my shoes are dirty already. It's fine. It's fine. Give him a hand. All right. All right. Before we go, let's say a quick prayer over this space. When I say, we ask you, God, you say, bless this place. You want to practice it once? Yeah. We ask you, God, bless, bless this place. place. Almighty God, you are the maker of the ground that we stand on. You are the creator of these families and of these children. <laughs> and we ask you, God, bless this place. Let's try that again. We ask you, God, bless this place. God, work your hands in the hands of all the construction workers and managers, all the folks who are actually building this thing, for all the folks who produced the parts and brought them here. May every piece of this equipment be blessed to your hands. We ask you, God, bless this place. For all the neighbors who are going to be using this space, may this be a blessing in their lives and a blessing for their children. We ask you, God, bless this place. For this congregation, may this be a spark in our hearts and a reminder to make room for our littlest ones. We ask you, God, bless this place. And for every kid who comes here, whatever else is going on in their lives, <laughs> May this be a place where they feel safe, where they feel your love, Almighty God. We ask you, God, bless, bless this place. place. And in God's name we say, Amen. 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 Go in peace, friends. And come right. and have coffee and cookies if you want. Yeah. All right. <laughs>